Hey y'all. Hey everyone. Welcome back to another video. <laughs> so I just want to hop on here and give you guys like a quick um a quick review. Um so uh for those of you who don't know, um I just did a I did a video. I recently did a video on this product, this product that I'm using. And no, this video is not for advertisement. I'm just sharing this video because someone else shared the information with me. So, uh, if you haven't, if you don't have the product that I'm talking about is Longevity. Um, I did an unboxing video. So, if you want to know more about it, I encourage you to go back and watch my unboxing video. And um, down in the description box down below, um, I shared the link. It's the link, and the link will take you straight to the website. So if you're interested in knowing more about the product and uh, how much it costs and all that, you can um, click on the link, and it'll take you straight to the website. So um, in my video, I shared it. Uh, I was introduced to this product by my brother, and this product is good for um, it's good for a lot of things. Like number, um, my brother, he told me about it because I was on blood pressure pill, on cholesterol pills which I, I'm still in on blood pressure pill, cholesterol pill, but I'm hoping that after using this product that um, I will be out of my blood pressure and cholesterol pill. But it's good for blood pressure, cholesterol, um, diabetes, uh, Alzheimer's, um, what else? Weight loss, all that stuff is good for it, so you know. But this is the vitamin D powder, and it's, uh, it's like a tangerine, and um, it's like a peach flavor. And so this is make uh, day three. This is my third day of taking this product. And so what I noticed is that um, it gives me a lot of energy. You know, it gave me some energy, especially now being that um, I came down with a cold. Yes, your girl, I came down with a cold. Um, going outside, no head on my head. The other day I went to my Thanksgiving service at church and I was rushing out the door to try to um, get my my ride was outside and running out the door. Didn't have time to put my coat on. All I had on was my usher uniform, and so I was coming down with a cold. So my voice is kind of a little raspy, but I've been taking tea, been um, sipping on this, and what I did was I just put a uh, pool like a half a cup of water and then put two scoops. Put two scoops of this, two scoops of this in in here, and then you just stir it up, and then you just, you know, I just been sipping on this, and um, like I said, it's, you know, I know this has been giving me a lot of energy, and then the next one is the, uh, this is the um, it's the essential fatty acid, acid, and um. I've been taking this. I've been taking this too. It says take it three times a day, but I've just been taking it one time a day. And um, it's like, you know, it supports the body in many ways, including cardiovascular health. Like that has to do with your heart. And so, yeah, I've been taking this. And then the other one is another powder. It's for, like, uh, healthy bones. I haven't started on that one yet. So, but i just been taking, um, i just been taking do these two because I didn't want to, like, take all three of them at once. I just wanted to see how these two work first. And then I'll try the one for the healthy bones. But, um, I just want to come on here and give you guys, uh, like, a quick, uh, review, you know, you know, how I'm feeling, how does it feel after I take it. And I will be doing another video, you know, on it, you know, letting you know how, you know, how I'm feeling, you know, after taking, you know, for a week or, you know, a month, let you know how it's been doing. Going. But so far, you know, I like it because, like I said, I was coming down with a cold and my energy level was just like real low. I just felt like real low. I didn't have no strength to like, you know, get up, like, you know, and I, not too long ago, I believe. Like, what was it? I think like two, maybe two weeks ago, a week before, I took my flu shot. I took my flu shot, so, um, you know, that it, it could be that too, but I know I've been going outside without my hat and my coat, like, I know I've been running out the door. So now, I got to make sure that, you know, I'm wrapping up with my hat on 
and then I want to build my immune system back up before I go back to work next week because I know when I go back to work, some, them kids, they be like them students, they be, I mean, they be coming with all type of colds and sickness, especially coming from the weekend, you know, and so, and then I tell them, I'm like, I'm not no doctor. I'm not no doctor, you know, they be I'm like, I'm not no doctor, I'm just a trained medical assistant. I'm I'm just a medical assistant. I work alongside a doctor, but I'm not a doctor, you know. So but uh, I be telling them, um, they be coming with all type of, you know, issues and stuff where well mama, my leg this and my leg feel like it's out of place. Mama, I got this, I got that, mama and this, and I'm like, I'm not a doctor. Wait, I'm not a doctor. I'm just a medical assistant. I'm looking like what you need to do is you need to let your mom know, you know, about these um these um uh, these issues that you're having in your body, you know, with your body parts, your leg and all that. Let your mom know so she can make an uh, make an appointment and take you to the doctor. Cause I'm just a medical assistant for this. All I all I do is my job is to um when they come in, they sick. I take their temperature. I take their temperature. Um, I look for symptoms, you know, like symptoms of like COVID and then any other, like if it's like a sore throat right away, you know, we have to call the parent, tell the parent they need to come get them because so throat cry, you know, they are contagious. So, you know, so I just take their temperature, you know, write down their symptoms or whatever. And, you know, and then I call their parent and, most of the time, they parent, you know, some of them, they'll come get them, and then some of them, they'll just say, hey, if these symptoms are not that severe, they'll say, hey, send them back to class. Then I have the ones that they just want to go. They just want to get out of class. They'll make up anything to get out of class, like they'll come in there, and then they'll tell me, um, you know, just make up something. And I'm like, you can go back to class. Like, you know, that's one thing I do, you know. And then, too, I use my discernment. I use spirit of discernment. I look at them, and then I just pray. And I'm like, okay, God, is, you know, they really sick? You know, they acting? And then something, you know, my spirit, like, you know, they trying to get, they try to go home. Like, I can tell the ones that are, you know, they're sick and the ones that's hitting on to just go home. So that's what I go through as, um, that's what I go through as a school nurse, you know, school uh health officer slash school nurse and reason why i said health officer slash school nurse is because i'm sorry y'all i got notification because sometimes i tell people i'm just a health officer and then some of them they only know that is they like health officer like, what is that i'm like you know and then i just tell them okay something like a school nurse and they're like oh okay i'm like so but i tell them you know you can call me health officer, you can call me school nurse, you can call me mama Melissa, but don't call me the COVID lady, you know, because they used to just call me the COVID lady. And I'm like, don't call me the COVID lady. You can call me health officer, school nurse, mama Melissa, but don't call me the COVID lady. I was somewhere, um, I was somewhere and I was doing some shopping and I ran into one of the students, one of the students at the school. And when he saw me, he was like, hey. You the coat? And I'm like, no, I'm not the COVID lady. So when we got back to school, I told him and I say, I'm not the COVID lady. You can call me Mama Melissa, but don't call me the COVID lady. I'm not the COVID lady, you know. Because sometimes people, and that's not just the students, the staff too. It's like when they see me, they run because they say, when we see you, we know it's something. We know we either got a, we got COVID or we got to take our test. So they run. So I don't want to, I don't want to, you know, put them at that, you know, the places where it's like, you know, they have feel like when they see me, oh, she's coming to me it's because I have COVID or I need to take my test. I don't want them to look at me, you know, as, uh, I got a notification, y'all. I don't know who this is calling. Hold on one second, y'all. When it's numbers that I don't know, I'm like, I don't answer them, so. But anyway, back to what I was saying. Um, you know, I'm like, I don't want them to feel that way. You know, when you see me, I want you to feel like it's you something good. You know, and some of them, I have to tell them, they're like, what? I got COVID. I'm like, no, you don't have COVID. Uh, you know, <coughs> oh, excuse me. No, you don't have COVID. I'm just coming to tell you that, you know, um, you didn't take your test or, you know, you're your test was good to go that's it so but like i said um yeah so i just been taking 
I've been taking drinking my tea, drinking um, a therapy fluid. I just been trying to build my immune system back up because I'm like, I got to go back to work my day. And then I did. I did take a rapid test today and the rapid test was negative. So that was good. So I'm like, it's just a common cold that, you know, I'm coming down with. And I'm just taking, trying to build my immune system back up. So, but that's all, y'all. I just want to come on here and chit chat. Let you guys know that, you know, I'm on day three of drinking, of drinking this product. Um, the Young Divi Beef, the vitamin powder. I'm on day three and, um, so far it's just been giving me a lot of energy and um but that's it i just want to come over here and say hello i hope that everyone has had a blessed a blessed thanksgiving um i hope it was wonderful mine was good um my daughter cooked i helped it was me my daughter cooked and our sis i helped her cook and then my sister she cooked some greens so but the food was good and um christmas i'm not sure christmas we plan usually christmas we do like a seafood boil you know so um we're gonna see how they go even do a seafood boil my sister she's like she just she want to cook so we're gonna see how that goes but um that's it um until next time it's your girl melissa be blessed in jesus name